Our top story here tonight is one that had a lot of you talking last night. A 16 year old caught up in a road rage incident. Tonight, family and friends are speaking out defending the teen. Good evening, I'm Brian Dorman. And I'm Lori Fulbright. Police say it was the 16 year old who caused a crash on Highway 169 that sent an innocent motorcycle rider to the hospital. But a family friend says the boy feels terrible about what happened and he stayed with the motorcyclist until help arrived. News on 6's Jordan Tedwell is live with this update for us. Jordan. Brian Lori, the family friend says he's a good kid who would do anything for anyone and he's traumatized by what has happened. Tony says she's known the 16 year old boy at the center of the road rage incident since he was a toddler. And this is a child that is not the person they're portraying. Tulsa police say a woman was driving north on Highway 169 and tried to exit at 71st, but the teenager was getting on the highway and wasn't happy she wouldn't let him over. He got upset threw a water bottle at her car. She then got in behind him to write his tag number down. Police say the teenager got off at 61st and was driving down the center lane when he crashed into a motorcyclist trying to turn left. Tony says the boy was scared because the woman followed him. She says this shouldn't have happened. In the defense of the child, like I don't feel like his name should be slandered because it could have been avoided, but had the lady emerged like a normal good Samaritan would and let someone on the highway, it could have all been avoided. Tony says the teenager is so upset by what has happened, he doesn't want to drive anymore. She says they are all thankful the motorcyclist will be okay. He could have ran. He could have did a hit and run and been so scared, but he stayed right there in, in that traumatic event and held his was ready for his consequence. Police gave three tickets to the teenager, reckless driving, violating his permit, and throwing an object from a moving vehicle. They say the motorcyclist is recovering from terrible road rash and a gash in the head. Jordan Tidwell, Oklahoma Zone, News on 6.